Welcome to Captured Online with Lynn Davis, fly fishing guide and casting instructor. Morning from the banks of the beautiful River Irvon. A bit of a change of plan today. We were hoping to get on the upper Y, but the gauges told me different this morning. So we cut our journey a bit shorter here. So we're on one of my favorite beats on the Irvon called the Colonel's Water. Um, difficult fishing, I'll be honest, but if you catch a grayling, then it's going to be a good one. Setup wise, as you can imagine, I got the Euronymph, my ever faithful Sage ESN 10 foot 3 weight. I'm using the Hens 9 meter tapered leader today, French leader. Attached to that is the short Hanak strike indicator, about 6 inches long, 5-6 inches. Attached to that is about 7 foot then of 5 pound fluorocarbon. And the point fly again is just the red tag with some Hens green. CDC, uh, gold tungsten bead, um, three or four mil, and the dropper pattern. Don't know the name of this actually, but one of my favourites. It's it's got a purple um, tail, which is great in love. It's got that hen's sort of peacock dub, and the furnace hackle again, and a silver bead about two and a half mil. So that's my um, Euro setup. Also brought along the dry fly with uh, the nine foot five weight. Attach to that uh, is probably a fourteen foot leader, tapered leader. With the tippet on the end down to about three pound at the moment. I've got a tiny little uh, traditional grayling pattern there, red tag, one of my favourites again. It's size eighteen. So if I see a fish rise today, grayling come up. Hopefully we'll cover it with that. Yeah, so that's the, the gear. Let's go fishing. Wow, happy days. <laughs> Lovely grayling to start the day, 17 inches. Okay, so serious tangle time, so time for a break I think. Um, coffee stop. So really, really enjoyed the first couple of hours. Uh, had one cracking grayling just down there, 100 yards away, um, 17 inches. Mostly trout, uh, to be honest, but uh, great, great fun. So I'm gonna have a bite to eat now, and we'll wander upstream. Ooh. Very fishy looking place, there he is. Oh, it's another trout. Sorry, Mr. Trout. Oh, he's off.
just making our way upstream here now and uh, seen two fish rise so I'm gonna cross the river and uh, try and fix, fix some dries upstream a couple of fish rise in front of me here now I think they're grayling Just float in. There he is. Oh, oh, that's a trout. I think the way it's fighting. It's a good fish. On a size 18 red tag. It's like a good fish. Yes, nice trout. trout. Full Irvon brown trout. Over a pound I would say. Look how pretty that is. Go on you. Sorry to disturb you out of season. There's quite a few fish rising just above me here. Yes. Come on. Yes. It's another trout. back quickly a couple of good uh, fish just ahead don't know if that was caught on camera I think it was you never know what they are hopefully it's a grayling I'm trying not to line them to my leader I won't come again Missed him again. <laughs> okay, so just seen a really nice fish rise under that tree, as you would imagine. So hopefully, the I'm pulling up now with the dry. Just there he was. A bit further up. A 
that's the one. Come on. Hmm. Is he further out to you? Just trying to get into position. A known hot spot here for me. A couple of years ago, I caught two lovely grayling out here, but it's, uh, it's a bit deep. <laughs> I'm on my tiptoes here at the moment. I'm trying not to get my pack too wet. These are the sort of places which hold the specimens, you know. The awkward places. Can't really get a good drift. Almost got to flick it downstream and uh, do a water hole, but it's a bit messy. Can't cast over my right shoulder. No, I'm gonna have to come out of this, I think, and move up. Okay, I'm in a slightly better position where I can cast over my right shoulder. Not ideal. Just trot your nose along there. Can you hear the acorns drop in? hooked into something here. I'm not sure what it is to be honest. What have we got here? Yeah. Oh. Hmm. Looks like a grayling maybe. Anyway, we call that the long range release. Never mind.
beautiful Irvon brown trout. You're covering the. No, you're not. You're not. Okay. We'll spare some in. Oops, sorry, Dad. And off he goes. <laughs> Let me show you the indicator here. Sorry. Yeah. Sorry. Just cut that. 